everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we're taking another look at The Mandalorian Season 3. So, last episode, Bo-Katan finally brought up that she saw a mythosaur, and the armorer seemed to brush that off. Uh, I'm not sure if she did that because she doesn't believe her, or just because it's, you know, not that big of a deal to her because she always believed that there might be one still around. I'm assuming we'll get our answer here shortly. I'm a bit concerned that we still haven't seen, like, the main plot line of this season. We're now five chapters in, and I have yet to see what the main story, what the main plot is is and maybe it's already been developing i just haven't seen it yet but the seeds are i've already been like planted uh but until that day comes <laughs> i still have no idea what the hell's going on but with all that being said your latest look at the mandalorian season three starts now Hold on a second. Uh oh it's a death star run oh it's the cabal from destiny so damn pirates. Atriox. This isn't Sabak. You can't put <laughs> your way out of this one. I don't you... hail me again unless it's to surrender. Bro, you held him first. What do you mean hail him again? Oh shit. Dude, where's my boy Hondo? Oh, those two guys were just having a full-on conversation, not caring. Yeah, I knew these pirates were coming back eventually. Man, that's so annoying. Bro just built up his whole city, instantly destroying it. It's like when you build a nice house in Minecraft and some creeper comes over and just sucks your shit up. Damn, kind of gives me Scarif vibes. Hey, the New Republic. Oh, it's those guys again. Too bad. Oh shit. Gonna make it. Oh shit. That guy look at Oh shit. He looks like the guy from Rebels. I haven't seen Rebels. Let's see. Is that actually him? Dude, is that the guy from Rebels? I've seen so many clips of him. Oh, that's so cool if it is. I need to watch Rebels. That got me hyped to watch Rebels if that's actually him. Maybe it's just the same species, I don't know. But I've seen a lot of clips with that guy. Bro, the situation is dire. Maybe put a little pep in your step, my guy. Oh, shit. Nah, dude. I think this is and now these events could all be connected. What? Because I'm hearing Moff Gideon never made it to trial. Captain. What? Rebellion anymore. Sounds like a rather imperial way of thinking. Captain, you're out of line. It's fine. He's out of line, but he's right. <laughs> be too late. That was the first order theme in the back a little bit. I heard that. It was slowed down a lot, but I heard that. I'm really liking that even though The Mandalorian has not been in this episode yet, it's still a compelling story. We'll make on the way. That was a cool transition. Oh, is he going to The Mandalorians? God, it's so cool to see an X-Wing. I love those ships. Oh. Thanks, R5. It's not your fight. I just came to tell you your friend is in danger. And I thought you should know. Man, bro's a real one. Bro, just show the dark saber. They're like, okay, okay, sir. They know Mandalore is not poison. Why don't they go relocate there, if anything? Oh, shit. Not Vizsla. Because we are Mandalorians. Damn. He's coming in clutch. God, bro's a real one. I was about to get upset. I for one will take up arms to fight by This is the way. This is the way. This is the way. 
This show's so fun. I'm a, I'm a. Cheers to that. Damn. Is that not the same room where Din and had that standoff with Moff? Oh, it's the same species as. Oh, I can't remember his name. The, uh, I have spoken guy. Oh! Damn! That callback line. Yo! Abu! Everybody come and look. Um. Oh, that sound effect of the alarm is the same one at Docking Bay 7 over on uh, Batu. Docking Bay 5. Oh, he's selling them out. Oh. Oh, yeah, there he is. Oh. Oh, that's not good. Oh. No. Oh, he's chilling. <laughs> oh, that did nothing for them. <laughs> she got her fighting too. <laughs> oh, they fighting too. <laughs> they got the Jawas fighting. Yo, that was badass. Oh, damn. He's targeting the townspeople. God, oh, they're getting messed up. That's a good shot. Damn. Well, there goes that guy. He was no Hondo Onaka. How did they get out there? They were in... What? Magistrate... Hi, Magistrate. <laughs> the fine people of Mandalore. Woo! No longer have Woo! Amara wishes to speak with you. Oh. Someone's in trouble. We're being promoted. Does she want to talk to her about the Mythosaur? Remove your helmet. Oh. Remove your helmet. Girl at the against the creed. She's stuck between a rock and a hard place. This is the way. This is the way. Oh, she did take that seriously. It is a sign. You are the one who can unite us. Oh, she's promoting it a leader. Or like insinuating that she should be. I'm, I'm sure Din wouldn't care. He'd be like, you can have the Darksaber. I really don't care. <laughs> oh. Pan walks both worlds. Damn. She's being... Bring all tribes together. She's being open-minded. Oh, shit. So we're going to go back. Oh, damn. I thought it was going to end there. Bro, she's chilling, patrolling space. Oh, hell no, nah, dude, go. <laughs> dude, go. Oh, it's... never mind, we're chill. Damn, that's terrifying. Oh, that can go out? What? Maybe R2 can't because he's an R2 and that's an R7. Oh, hell nah, dude. That's where Moff Gideon was, huh? Parched times. I knew it. He never made it to trial. Someone broke him out. There don't appear to be any 
Rivers. It's a fragment of Beskar alloy. Are you saying that Moff Gideon oh. was taken by... What? Who would do that? Who? What? What other myth? What? Unless, like, so much... Could be not Boba Fett, right? No. He's the only other... Has to be like another Mandalorian out there, dude. Bum 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 Moff Gideon is not... I couldn't think of anything. There you will go. There is my latest reaction to The Mandalorian Season 3. So, a seemingly filler episode or like one-off episode turned into something very important, which I really love about this show. I literally just said at the beginning of this video, I don't know what the main conflict is. I don't know what's going on. There's just been like random kind of like, yeah, like random filler episodes leading up to this. But... I really love that all the little things that happen in those episodes lead up to a much bigger plot and then you go back and watch and you're like, oh my god, that's so cool. Kind of like how they did it in season one and season two and I just needed to be patient. I was just so excited to get to like what's going on. Uh, you know, you just kind of forget to be patient sometimes. It's just probably because this season is very short. Yeah, eight episodes is not that much time when it comes to something you've been waiting for for a very long time. So I think that's where it's rooted from. I think the show is at its strongest sometimes. Sometimes when it really does focus on like the action and the Mandalorian action at that, it's so fun seeing all this, you know, tribe or clan work together to try to further its people. You have the armor accepting the other clans to try to unite Mandalore. They seem to want to reclaim their planet. There was just a lot going on here. Most importantly, we had a few returning faces. We had that character who I think is from Rebels, which is really cool. Um, makes me want to actually watch the show because I've only seen clips and scenes and I have the gist of what happens in Rebels. I just haven't seen the show in its entirety. So I'm sure there's bits and pieces and character development. I'm most definitely missing out on. But I have a general idea who everyone is. It's just names and stuff I don't really know quite yet. If you guys want me to react to Rebels, just let me know down in the comments below. That would be a really fun series to do. But like I said, I've already seen some of it, so I can't really react to the whole thing. Moff Gideon is just AFK, apparently. Someone broke him out in between season two and three, and it's been a long time in between two and three. I believe it's been two years. So what has he been up to? What is he planning? Are we going to see the rise of the First Order here? Because they also had those returning characters from episode three or chapter three, or not chapter three, chapter 19 or 20. I forgot which chapter it was, where we had that whole Coruscant-centered episode. But uh, looks like that's going to be a much bigger play plot later on. But thank you all so much for watching. If you like this, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe if you are new. Let me know what your favorite moment was down in the comments below. And if you want to be notified every single time I upload a new Star Wars reaction, don't forget to hit that notification bell. And once again, thank you all so much for watching and I'll see you guys in my next look at The Mandalorian Season 3. Subscribe to Zang Helios for some more on Freaking Book.